on out of that student union. Climb on into the lecture hall because those doors are open. Hey, it's days for dummies. <laughs> uh, it's 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 me, Matt. There's Cat. There's your attendance. And I imagine Angela is rushing through the hallways right now with her arms full of papers, you know, loose leaf mm -hmm. papers and files, right? They're mm -hmm. flying behind her as she's rushing through the masses of the student body. She's got coffee in her hand. Rushing. She's got a full schedule, just smart like Marlena, you know. But Marlena's just trying to keep everybody like <laughs> not going crazy. Yeah. She's so good at it, isn't she? <laughs> she's the only therapist in town, folks. Everybody trusts her so much. Everybody even knows her. Everybody trusts even, her. She's even been the devil, and everybody still trusts her. Oh, she's been dead. She's been the devil. She's, she's done been. It all. <laughs> she's been Mrs. Black. <laughs> she's been um. She's been Mrs. Brady. She has. You know. Isn't she? Isn't she Sammy's <laughs> mama? Who's? Sammy's. Yes, because that isn't Sammy Eric's twin sister, right? Yes. And Sammy, and, and so that makes, and then and Marlena and Roman had Eric. I guess. I think. I don't know. We haven't been watching enough to see, you know. I'm I, pretty I, sure it's Roman. Me, what I have discovered, though, with Days of Our Lives is no one raises their, well. <laughs> it's kind of a No one raises thing. their own child from zero to 18. What, what, what character on a soap opera does, though? Yeah, that's true. You know, like like even Tad didn't raise Jamie from zero to eighteen. No, because he didn't know that Jamie was his kid because exactly. uh, Brooke lied about it. <laughs> right? Well, isn't it Dixie's kid? No. No. Jamie's is Brooke's kid is Oh, he was yeah. just close to JR. Yes. Which brought Dixie into his life a lot. Yes. But um, yeah, Jamie's his kid, and and Brooke lied about it for a long time. Got it, got it. Oh, Brooke, oh Brooke English, oh what a villain! <laughs> <laughs> hey Kelly, hey Jacarius, good morning everybody. Like I Hi Jacarius, hey Jacarius, did you hear me just say the name Sammy? <gasps> I did. I mean, yeah, Jacarius likes Sammy. Kaiwan likes Sammy. Uh, yeah. There's all kinds of people who like Sammy, but you know who doesn't like Sammy? Days of Our Lives. She's not on. Alice, I know. She's I, so I, busy. I, I, I think she'll be back. Allison Sweeney always goes back to Days of Her Life, doesn't she? Uh, yeah. You know, I don't think she's ever like. I want her to go like, back because I, I want to know what all the hype is. What? No, she's not been on. You know, is, is she like days is, in the time we watched it? Is it like is it like getting excited for like Allie Mills? You know, when Allie Mills is is going to be on, you're like, ooh. You know, is it is it like that? Well, I don't know yet, because I have some experience watching Allie Mills. I know, I know. We have a lot of experience, especially recently. The only, you know, the only experience I have watching Allison Sweeney is is uh, <laughs> the biggest loser. <laughs> that's that was my just only a hosting experience gear. watching her. That was just hosting. I know. <laughs> the, host, the hosty mosty for, mm. on that show. Uh, Jacarius does say, I do love me some Samantha Jean Brady. Well, I... I, like I said, I need to know what the hype is. I hope she's dead. Yeah. Well, hey, you know, with with uh, you know, Doug, 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 the character Doug, he he was he was far reaching in days. And um, from my understanding, I saw a little blurb on the internet. Now, you know, don't come here for the news; take it for what it's worth. But um, I saw something where Julie, the, mm -hmm. you know, real life Julie, yes, um, was given the uh, given the task of. Doug's memorial on the show. Oh, they Which, want her to write it? I don't know if necessarily if like write the lines, but what's the idea? What's the concept? What are we doing? Oh, so they want her. Okay. Well, I think that's beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, I, I saw that somewhere. I can't tell point where on the internet I saw it. Mm -hmm. So like I said, you know, don't ever come here for the news because, you know, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So um, I, if that's true, that sounds really nice. Her name is Susan Seaforth Hayes, isn't yes. it? Yes, yeah. I just don't ever right. remember anything when I'm broadcasting. Well, you know, I don't remember it on time, but I remember it eventually. Exactly. So, yeah, Susan, uh, I, I saw something uh, that Susan is, is has been given the reins, uh, so mm -hmm. to speak, when it comes to this upcoming memorial. Mm-hmm. So, you know, that's if good. that's the case, that's awesome. You know, it could be very cathartic that's, that's for her. That's lovely. She worked yeah. with her husband all those years. And she married to him all those years, too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Kelly reminds us that Allison Sweeney does a lot of Hallmark movies, Ma. So if you wanted to see Allison Sweeney, 
not be Sammy. Well, There's plenty of opportunity I there. I don't really care about seeing Allison. I want to see Sammy. <laughs> I want to see her portrayal of Sammy because Sammy's got quite a reputation. Mama, are you are you are you gonna are you gonna like sneak into like some abandoned warehouse tonight? You look like you're in your sneaking gear. You look like you're kind of in oh, a little yeah. cat suit. You know, like you're gonna well, go no. break in. No, I it, I have a hoodie on. It's it's it's. Peace, oh. love, and GH. Oh, love it, love it. <laughs> yeah, because it just it just kind of like you know all I, you know it's dark here, uh -huh. and so your head's out, and you, you just you just look like you're about to like go break Clyde Weston out of jail. Well, or sneak up and poison him. Man, I tell you, wouldn't that be a fun character to play? Clyde Weston. No, you well, the is... assassin. The, you get the hired to, to play the assassin that's hunting down Clyde. I think Ava should be able to take him out. I just got to get out of bed with uh, with Harris first, right? <laughs> Man, this is just like a magnetic seal. Yeah, I mean they they gave us the impression that they do it did it all night and then half the day the next day. It's, they they just they do they're, they're just bunnies. They are. They're bunnies, mother. They just can't keep their hands off of one another. You know what? I I saw some. I don't know why I saw this. Speaking of bunnies, happy yeah. Easter. Happy. Well, I think I maybe I saw this because it was Easter time, and you know, did you know bunnies? You know how and people say, oh well, they 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 reproduce like bunnies. Yes. Well, bunnies gestation is only like. I don't know, 25 days or something? It's very short. It's very short. Also, also, and thank goodness this is not what humans do. When bunnies, when bunnies have their time, it signals yeah. the female bunny to drop a mass of eggs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So when a mommy bunny and a daddy bunny are um, deeply in love with one another and expressing <laughs> that, uh, it, it, it triggers the biological response in the mommy bunny to have a baby. Yes. Isn't that something? Yeah. 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 She, I think there's a couple of animals out there that, that do that. Ovulates um, because of the fact, mm -hmm, not yeah. in just a normal kind of, you know, cycle. And, and it's because bunnies are food. They are. So they got to do it real yeah. quick. Out there in the world. <laughs> yes. They got to have a lot of little bunnies real fast. Otherwise, they'd go extinct because boy, oh boy, does nature eat bunnies. You know what I, you know what I wanted to, I, I was thinking about, you know, our, our um, story that we did with James. Mm -hmm. Okay. About the hair. Yeah. The Easter hair. Check that out. It is the Easter hair, now. right? You know what I wanted to say at the end of that? When I was dying? Hmm. You ain't nothing but a jackrabbit. <laughs> <laughs> you always got everybody always comes up with the best lines afterward, because you know. That's what a hair that's what a jackrabbit is. You ain't nothing but a jackrabbit. You ain't nothing but a jackrabbit. I've been all the time. <laughs> Kelly appreciates our birds birds and the bees about bunnies. Well there you go, folks. <laughs> come, don't come here for the news, but come here for biological facts. Animal anatomy <laughs> one oh one. Here at Salem University. Well, I don't know. I guess I'm not too old to learn something. Huh? I didn't know that about the bunnies. Oh, I, I suppose. So this is a bodily function. So it's not anatomy. It's physiology. Yeah. Anatomy would be where it all occurs. Physiology yeah. is why and how. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. So, you know, that that's what we're taking after, you know, days 101. We've got bunny physiology 102 uh, coming, up, coming up at 12. <laughs> um, I wonder what sort of classes Holly and, and Tater are going to eventually take when they go to college. How to sneak around. Boy, and you know not what? get caught. I I didn't realize till this week actually of what um these two got of how to act in front of your parents <laughs> down to a science. <laughs> because when they step out of that, those two are rotten. Both of them. And they both don't give a damn either. No, nah, they just care about seeing each other. We're going to oh make out under the old oak tree at school. I mean, I understand. They're teenagers. I understand. Not only are they teenagers, but they're teenagers who parents are telling them to not see each other. Right. 
Now, I know that he's got hormones and stuff, but Ted should be a little more pissed about all this, you would think. Ollie threw him under the bus for a long time. But then she got over it and said she was sorry. Yeah. She's telling the full truth now. She's not holding anything back. I wonder I wonder if the show will... will uh, they don't really have a reason to, but I just wonder if they will switch out Har Holly as well. I, I don't, I don't know. I, um, well, because of 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 the presumed maturity difference between the two actors now. Yeah, that was presumed. I because I did expect him to. Because you like you know we talked about earlier. Yes, his still photo. He does look older than uh our, the our Tate. Mm -hmm. But uh, when I saw him on TV. On a regular show, he doesn't look so much. Youth older, is also really. an energy, you know. Yeah. So. But he does have a. He does look a little more masculine than the other young man. That's but fair. But he doesn't look older. I, I I thought I thought and I think I said before I don't know if it was on the broadcast or before, uh, but I I thought that he that this actor takes after Brady while the other one had taken after Teresa. I agree. Yes, I agree. The older Tate did kind of look a little more like Teresa, mm -hmm. you know, more pointed features. Yeah, yeah, narrow face, kind of a paler complexion, definitely with the mm -hmm. blonde hair. Well, this mm -hmm. one's, you know, tall, dark, and handsome. But this one is more Brady-ish, yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, I, don't, I, I think that Teresa and Brady are really going to... I don't know. Teresa, though, she's dastardly -ish. You know, she... You, she really wanted to be with Brady. Oh, she'd have fallen into his arms if she if he had made a move for sure. Brady needs to just not be around these women and do what I recommend a lot when it comes to soap characters is find somebody new to date. Right? Stop sniffing around your old stomping grounds, Brady. I know. Move on and find somebody else. You, could it be? you good looking dude. You ain't gonna have they, no problem finding someone else. Mm -mm, it's days. They, they they will introduce a character for you, or 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 change the character that somebody is playing. You know, like we, they will make room mm -hmm. very easily. Well, I'd rather see Brady sniff around um, Teresa than Kristen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but neither one of them are really good women. No, no, definitely. Uh, but Teresa, you know, Teresa still wants Alex. So, uh, Jeannie wants to know where's Angela. I wish I could tell you. I guess she's still rushing through the hallways, carrying her papers with her hot copy. She was supposed to pop in. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. I don't know. Uh, and then she, and then she follows up uh, saying that I think the actress who's playing Holly is 22. So she just be young that. looking. She just looks like a little teenager. Sure. She's doing the, the 90210 thing. I mean, sure, you know, when, you, when you're 22, my goodness, there's lots of 22-year-olds that look 15. None of them. <laughs> oh, what is that Chris Rock song? What? If, she, if, she's, if she's 18 and she says she's 18, she's 40? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Chris Rock did say that. I don't, I don't know if, if the lyrics like that are okay nowadays. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, I tell you, I... I, I, I I always say this, but, you know, in the United States, we get our panties in a bunch about things that don't matter, and we let go everything that does. You I know, don't get I, it. I, I, I think that we need to find a, a nice balance, you know. I, I think that we were almost there in, like, 98 to 2004, where things were a little seedy, but they weren't as seedy as they had been. <laughs> but they weren't as crystal clean as they are now. And I'm talking in just, like... um. I don't know if you've noticed this, but I, I have because I pay attention and I don't know what the world does or not. Um, but boy, oh boy, ma, um, characters on movies and television are squeaky clean unless they are complete trash. Um, it's, it's, it's really hard to find like nuance. Like what's, what is the great flaw of this hero? There really aren't any anymore. They pick we, up the, the, we the can't gun. do anything to humanize anybody, but we can make them the devil. We have to make them look squeaky clean, like you said, or the devil. It's one way or the other, and um, people, there's just, there's no nuance, and I think it's kind of connected to once somebody finds out one negative trait about a person, and mm -hmm. that's it. Yeah. I can never talk to this person again. They're canceled. The world's a mess. 
it is. <laughs> um, but I'm happy that, you know, that, that, that doesn't exactly always trickle down into soaps. You know, we still got some terrible people on soaps. We still got some complicated heroes. We do. So that's yeah, good and we, have, we we do have, you know, we we do have our share fair of villains that are, you know, underneath it all are just misunderstood to a certain mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not Clyde. I'm no. just waiting for him to pop up. I know. Because he, he's, he's a presence. You know, they haven't stopped talking about him. No, they haven't stopped talking about him. He took off with his girlfriend. But we haven't seen him since. Is this, is, is, it, was that it? Well, you, you just, he just... He broke out and ran off to Tahiti with a girl. He did. Yeah, and then and that's it. Story over. Was that Goldman or Goldberg? Was it Goldman? Goldman. Goldman. Officer Goldman. Goldman. Yeah. We should have known. This brand new yeah. character that we've introduced to the force. How dare she? We mm -hmm. never saw it coming. <laughs> Harris got tricked. Oh uh, yeah. So did um. <clears throat> so did so did. So did uh, Ray. So did, so did Jada. And Jada, yeah. So what what does what Rafe know, Ma? What is this thing that Rafe knows? I don't know about Ava. We don't know yet, do we? Some, somebody called him, right? So, so so he was there, and he's like, hello, right? And then, and then uh -huh. he's like, oh, my God, I can't he's believe like, that. This is going to change the world. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and he hangs up, and then he rushes over and goes to tell Ava, hey, it's a foot. But what's going on? Yeah. Tell we me. We don't know. Kelly? Jeannie? Jacarius. <laughs> Angela! <laughs> Tell me what's going on. So what does it mean if we show up more than the professor? Do we get straight A's? We are filling our own grade. Ooh. You left her laptop, we'll just break into her stuff and just... Right? We'll call Spinelli and we'll get... And we'll have him break we'll into... Just hack, I mean, I know her laptop password. It's 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 Charlie 2024. So... <laughs> You know, we'll just hack right in. <laughs> it probably is in Charlie 2024. <laughs> uh, Kelly loves your hoodie, Mama. Oh, well, thank you. It's from General Hospital. Yes. yes. Peace, Peace, love, love and, and GH. GH. With the little yeah. bleeps, bleeps. And I got it free because I won a contest that day at the convention. Goodness. Oh, what a, what a good I time. won a bunch of stuff at you the won convention. A bunch of stuff. You you The owner was so pissed. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey folks, if you if you're running an event or a business, don't offer something you're not willing to give out. Exactly. He was not here. He was irritated. He was irritated that and we you, had And you ma, if they never have the con convention ever again, you get to walk away as the supreme trivia champion, never defeated. I know because they might never have another convention. They're not you having it. The reason church. why they didn't have the next convention is because you took all the money. Um, I, yeah, I, you know it. It should have been. It should have been uh, coming up in the next uh, three to four months, and they should have been selling tickets for it and whatnot if they were going to do it. So it's, it's looking like twenty twenty four for the Burbank GH convention. We're, we're going to figure it out. We're going to go to the Emmys instead. We are. We're, we're going to cross our fingers that Sophia Matson's going to be there. So we can be like, Sophia, Sophia, do you have time for a few questions? Yeah. And then she did, did they open that up yet for to, to nah, apply? Not yet. Not yet, huh? Were they going to wait forever? What the heck? I, I saw it's in the same location. Is it? Yes, it is. Oh. It's well, in the Bonaventure again. Well, then maybe, maybe less people will apply. Maybe. Because other press out there did not enjoy that experience. No, we didn't have anything to compare it to. So we were kind of, you know, we were thrilled no matter you know, what. We got lucky too in our space. You know, there's no guarantee that we would be that lucky again. We might, you know, if we, we, we could get mashed between soap opera digest and, you know, um, good, you know, the, the pie lovers anonymous, you know, <laughs> I have no idea. I don't know, Mother. Otherworldly 2003 made it. Hello, Otherworldly, one of our top commenters. Leaves comments on all of our videos every week as they watch. Well, let's go back. Let's go, let's let's go back to. Are we done talking about Ava and? Um, well, yeah, I mean, we got, all I do. We got I did distracted really... bunnies because they were doing it like bunnies. I mean, all so... you know, they they just that that's what they're doing, and uh, and then and then Rafe was like, oh my gosh, the secret, and that was pretty much what their contribution was this week. And they went to the bistro and cleaned it up and yeah. made some pasta. And it was and, just a sweet time. 
it was they oh Ava and Harris are liking each other quite a bit. Oh yes, goodness. They are. See, you know we're we're just gonna have to set up for big tragedy. Exactly. Big heartbreak. It is Ava going to be loses big the tragedy. love of her life. It's gonna be tragedy. Because he likes Port Charles and General Hospital more. <laughs> I'm gonna go hang out with Laura Wright. She's my preferred Carly, and then he leaves. You know what though? I was thinking. And and I, this is just you know, I just thought that Ava and Harris's love scenes were very very believable, and I just wonder if Tamara and Steve got a thing for each other now. <laughs> Maybe they've always had a little thing for each other. Maybe they've just always been able to access that part of their lives because Maybe they find Tamara each other so Steve hot. Got a little thing going. I don't know, mm -hmm. or just you know, they just have been doing love scenes. For, for soap operas for so long, they're just really good at it and very convincing. Maybe, maybe, maybe. maybe. And hey, you know, maybe. maybe, 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 you know, maybe you're right. Maybe they do have a little spark for one another. But just because you have a spark doesn't mean that you act on it in real life. No. But maybe it feeds into their performance. I have no idea what uh, the love life of, uh, of uh, Tamara Braun is. I have no idea either. Or Steve... Or Steve Burton, he's pretty, he's pretty, keeps all his personal life pretty close to his chest. I mean, I imagine it's complicated because he, he's a man of faith. So that means he's not just going to go out slanging. Um, and then also at the same time, he does have a measure of responsibility, which I think that he probably takes seriously when it comes to being um, a celebrity in, in the soap world. And it would be probably pretty easy for him to find a 50 to 65 year old person who is down 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 but is that a responsible use of your fame not really it's not fair either right so you know uh, i can imagine it can be very complicated for him in this new world uh mm -hmm. that he's living in to let you know i love the new tate says jacarius well that's great and we like him okay too yeah yeah Jeannie wants to know if we watched friday of course we watched friday how else do we know all this Everett stuff? Yeah. So. You know, because the whole week ended with him being like, I'm not that man. No. Uh, that's forgery. I don't care if it's my fingerprints and my face. We've proven it. It's my birth name. I've been married. There's a whole life. I'm not him. Hey, that was dumb. It was so dumb, was Mom. I got to say. I got to say. That, that was that's dumb. The, that was the, <clears throat> the credits started to roll. And my thought was, Really? <laughs> yeah um but i it was interesting when he went to go see marlena and he got hypnotized and i tell you what that of marlena she is quite a psychiatrist she can just have you sit in one uncomfortable stiff chair across the, across the desk from her and if she just tells you go night night you do just like that <laughs> she is the most uh successful most powerful most um um just the most influential She's magic, I tell you. She's psychologist magic. in the history of mankind. Um, there really is no reason to have any other therapists in Salem because everybody can go to Marlena because she not only has time to visit everybody once a day, uh, you know, an hour every day, mm -hmm. but she can also be an attentive and loving wife, a good she mother. Can. And one day, if she isn't right now, a great grandma. Is she your grandma? I don't know. I don't know well, who she, all of her kids are. Jude is her grandson. Yeah, there you go. I keep on forgetting about Jude because Jude is a blanket. <laughs> yeah. Man, that was so disappointing. We couldn't even christen a baby. Wait, to christen a blanket too? Dang. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, goodness. Uh, Jacarius grew up, he says, grew up watching the new Tate when he was on the Disney Channel. Oh, yeah, I heard he did some Disney stuff. Yeah, yeah, he was on, like, I don't know what the, like, the, the Disney shows are now, you know, I stopped really paying yeah. attention after, like, iCarly, which was a long time ago. It's been, well, like, 20 my daughter years. Moved, well, my daughter grew up and moved out. I didn't have to watch all that Yeah, nonsense. I don't, I really don't know what the current offerings are. Uh, you know, I was, I was the, the generation, and I was even too old for these shows, but I was watching them because I'm a dork like that, but, you know, um, like, even Stevens and Lizzie McGuire and. 
the oh, tween the shows last, when I was a teen. <laughs> I think the last thing I saw wasn't necessarily Disney. Well, Hannah Montana? Yeah, that's Disney. That's that's probably what I saw. And it was also 20 years ago now. Yeah. It's wild, Ma. Cause it, so Taylor Swift, you know, she's having a big tour, and she's like, I can't believe I've been doing this for, for 21 years or something. And I'm like, oh, my God. Well, the Taylor Swift's like this. I think she's a year younger than your sister. It's just wild because I'm like, I can't really like that long, Taylor. Really, I, I mean, I, I could be wrong about the number, but my God, it, it just it just slapped me across the face because in my mind, she's this 16 year old country star, but she haven't been that in a long time. No, she's met. Oh my God, she's like a huge star. Yeah, it's like, yeah, like when I no, think she, of her, it's like. She's it's like Madonna, a, Beyonce, famous. What was it? I wear short shirts. T wears t-shirts. You know mm. that one? I'm yeah. in the bleachers. That's that's who I think of, and that is a long Cheer time ago. I'm in the bleachers. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that's that's old. That is old music. It is. It, like the young kids today would be like, oh my god, that's Taylor Swift. Yeah. <laughs> but Taylor Swift's got. I think she has great music. She's, and she writes it. She's actually quite talented. Did you notice how everybody cared about the fact she was dating that football player and now nobody cares because the football season's over? Of course. Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. I bet, you know, I bet, they, I bet they really enjoy that right now, too. <laughs> she's so important. She's invaded our soap opera podcast, everybody. I know. You can't get rid of her. Swifty, not really. There's no corner you can turn in which people aren't talking about Taylor Swift. <clears throat> Swift. Oh, I know this for sure. If I had a daughter like Holly, you would I would not have held myself back. Oh, see, they just can't show have... it on TV. Oh, my goodness. That Holly. Tell you, the little actress, though, man, when it comes to telling off your mom and breaking her heart, you did a great job. <laughs> broke your mom's heart. Absolutely well, broke her heart with that meanness. That little girl. Oh, my goodness. Was she wrong? She wasn't necessarily wrong. Not necessarily wrong about all of it, but no. Here, here's the thing, and I um, would have pow powed her. Um, and I, it becomes more and more true, I think, as time goes on. And I think we've been lucky in our family having avoided this so far. Uh, but 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 what Holly said about her life being the phone mm -hmm. is totally true. It's true. Like. I've seen I've seen YouTube clips and videos and fail videos and that sort of stuff of young people being separated from their phones. Mm -hmm. It's like it's like you've stolen their hand. Exactly, exactly. I think you know stealing to take not stealing but taking your your teenager's phone away. Man, it's, it's kind like of how, crazy. How am I supposed uh, to function? How am I literally supposed to do anything? Exactly. Exactly. It kind of reminded me of, this was an old video I saw a long, long, long time ago. And it was this 20-something young man hmm. playing video games and his dad saying, I'm done with this. You need a job. You need to grow up. You're not 15. You're, you know, da-da-da. And he put them all out in the yard. Uh -huh. And then he got his ride on lawnmower. <laughs> yeah. And ran over all that crap. And that guy, that, that you know, make-believe teenager, he about turned himself inside out. Yeah. He was <laughs> so... What? <laughs> he was so... He was something. Yeah, but yeah. I think that's the kind of reaction. It's just, they, sure. it's just it's like, it's like, it's like, literally, it's like cutting their hand off, mm -hmm. running off with, and they're like, I, how am I supposed to open a door? How am I supposed to do my homework? How am I supposed to do anything? Mm -hmm. uh, so it's like... You know, well, um, it is, you know, and it is in some instances, you kind of do need your phone, kind of, but I don't know, you know, like I would give, maybe I'd give the phone back to a, to the kid for a few minutes and then take it back again for the stuff that it really were necessary. I'm so I glad could, I really didn't have to do much of that, you know, what, what could possibly be super necessary at 16, 17 years old on your cell phone. You're not paying not bills. Really. You're not checking your schedule. No, um, there's nothing that you like. She took her phone, not her laptop. Exactly. 
Exactly. That's what I was about to say. Because if there's anything that you really have to see for school or whatever, your yeah. phone's not your only option for mm -hmm. viewing. It. Mm -hmm. It's just not convenient. You're not texting. That's probably the main thing that you know, you're taking away. No Snapchat. Uh, I don't know exactly what it is. <laughs> but you can still browse Instagram, Twitter, Facebook on a computer. She's probably not on Facebook, though. That, that's the social media for old people. That's what they say, yes. That's what they say. If you're looking for your parents, look on Facebook. <laughs> if you're looking for true, your kids, but... look on TikTok. <laughs> or Insta. Insta. We'll see if TikTok survives. You know, the government passed a ban. No, I heard that. They said, hey, you know, you, you person who's invested in this company, you have to divest from this company or you can't operate in the United States. Yeah. It's very personal. But, yeah, I, I don't know. There must be something behind all that. that it has know. something to do with um, um, security or whatever. worries about national security because this investor is, is from China, I think. Mm -hmm. And just the way that social media is set up, it's pretty much free access to millions of Americans' locations and... Mm -hmm. habits and yada yadas yes so that's the concern Build an algorithm and national get an awful security lot of anyway. you know and that's not a statement saying that any other country is intending to do wrong toward us i'm just saying that that's what the concern is i guess oh goodness cell phone uh... so what did so what did you think of paulina and marlena's um lunch and i liked it yeah they're, they're they're fine they're good they're they're nice together i mean it's it's a couple of like you know, really seasoned actors. You don't, you don't, I tell you the scene I thought, hey. I thought that was just kind of like a waste of time this week. Hmm. And the wardrobe was <laughs> weird as all get out. Is it, is it, is it Leo? No, no, it was, um, it was a uh, Lucas. They had to remind us that he's upstairs in that room still and can't do nothing. Oh yeah. Well, hey, uh, they, uh, he needs... that was the, that was the whole purpose of the scene. It looked like because there was nothing new. It was to it just was remind just, us. Hey, you guys, don't forget we got Lucas up here, and uh... he's still dressed like a monk <laughs> <laughs> in the monastery. Oh. Hi, everybody. She made it. Yay, I made it. <laughs> I'm sorry. To, we're about to steal your great book and fill in whatever we wanted i'm sorry well i mean what else is new right this the inmates are running this asylum <laughs> <laughs> so i'm over here with my great aunt at my great aunt's house Hi. hello welcome to the internet auntie hello there. and uh yes so but i just had to hop on because i had to say harris neva harris neva harris neva maybe well, they'll we get out of the bed now that you've said earlier. their name three times we were talking I know. About earlier, and I said, well, you know, I don't know if it's because they're such seasoned pros when it comes to love scenes, or it seemed like Tamara and Steve kind of really like each other a minute. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's because Jarly exists in every universe. <laughs> They're just Everyone. pulling that in. Energy. Are you frozen or am I frozen? Yeah, whatever. Yeah, it's not the best connection. Absolutely. It's Jarly across the soap opera multiverse, guys. You well, have to know that. Like they I'm like, like and... Spider Man, there are the canon events. You know, Uncle Ben must die exactly. every time there's Ex Spider Man. Well, <laughs> well they the keep on jumping died. on each other like that. They're going to need like some Waitman and some Sav and stuff. They're going to be bald. <laughs> this is how they keep Harris on the show as Ava becomes pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I know, but the only thing with knowing that he's leaving, they'll make it freaking Stefan's kid because he's leaving, mm -hmm. and that would be very sad for me. But whatever, <laughs> it is what it is. Um, I think it, we're gonna have a pregnant Ava. I don't know. That would be really weird because, like, her son's a total doctor. Her son's a doctor. You know, Sounded like yeah. underwater there for a second. <laughs> oh, no, I was saying that her son's a doctor, so she's a little up there. And he wasn't mm. even her old, youngest, oldest. Yeah, didn't she have another son, right? Yes, the psycho Charlie. Yeah. yeah. Oh, now, Charlie. Yeah. He came back last as a zombie. Great. Um, during the devil possession. 
Mm-hmm. Also, Zari was a zombie I just too. want to tell everybody all of our days, all of our days fans, on behalf of one of the other Yeti Mike bitches, hop over onto Suds and Square Circle and vote in their March Madness. That's right. They're the final, the finals of their big March Madness. John tournament. Black is is. Yes, it's John Black versus somebody from the Bay. Uh, from so, uh, Jackie Zeman, and of course our silver foxes. So it's it basically away. the finals: is Jackie Zeman was it? versus Drake Hogeston. Yeah. Well, so visit darn. their Twitter: Suds and Squared Circle. Yes, and vote, 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 vote. See if John Black walks away as the very first March Madness character champion. That's why. Of all, so Ma, I don't know if you ever saw it, but it was said it was all of the soaps, and mm-hmm. all of the soaps had like infighting yes. first. It was set up just like basketball. Vinny, he put some he did. work into this. So all of the soaps got whittled down from their characters into like their top one as voted okay. by the fans. And then mm-hmm. the top characters from each show faced off and got voted on. And now we're in the finals. Yep. And it's Jackie Zeman versus yeah. Greg Hogeston. Of all of the actors and all of the characters in Soapland, these are the two that have made it to the end of this. Mm-hmm. Outlasting Drake's got a little disadvantage. And I think... Um... Voting goes until next Thursday or Friday. So go over there, get your votes in, because uh, soap opera podcasters are a family. As Angela continues to swim, we're going to continue to encourage you. The big table, plenty of seats. Gosh, I don't know why. It's just, it's just a lame connection, that's all. Yeah, you don't have a strong connection. That's all. That's all. That's all. But everybody's well, happy to I see you. I was just saying that we are a family. Yeah. Of soap podcasters. And they're family. They're all family. We just sit here with a dawn. You got a ring. You get <laughs> Kiss it. Don't ever take sides against the family. I know what you did, Fredo. <laughs> I know what you did. Don't ever take sides against the family. Yeah. Grab yep. your face. I knew it was you. I like that we'll Finola's uh, hanging in there for you. He retaped her. I retaped her. I finally oh, okay. applied oh. a little, a little extra tape, as she's hopefully going to last. Until she morning. tries to, until she tries to, until she needs to jump go ship again, and run mm-hmm. off and try to go make out with John Jagger. She's <laughs> <laughs> not gonna make out with John Jagger. He's so weird. And they have great chemistry, but Finola has chemistry with a tree. So yeah, yeah, yeah. She's got yes, but... chemistry with her reflection. Yeah, right. yeah, absolutely. <laughs> God, yeah. <laughs> so. oh, let's see here. What's else? Uh, EJ and Brady almost beat the car out of each other, so that's fun. Um, mm-hmm. Nicole almost beat the tar out of uh, Holly, which is also fun. Um, almost, almost. Oh, lots, lots Angela, almost. I'd have slapped the crap out of that little girl. Oh my <laughs> God, she would have woken up next week. I Action. would have slapped. The, I would have kapow powder. Yeah. <laughs> After all that, oh, and if I was Nicole or Teresa, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. that's my baby. That's my baby, she said. That says. you did that to. Exactly. Exactly. Mm-mm-mm-mm. And I thought, mm-hmm. um, and I know Tate, I know Tate <clears throat> is just really got the hots for her and everything. And he, he is a teenager, mm-hmm. but he should be a hell of a lot more mad at Holly than what he is. <clears throat> yeah, the teenage boys, you know, more so than any other men, God only gave them enough blood to run one brain at a time ah, <laughs> only one of them and tate's is focused on his and his the lower teenage brain. boys always choose the southern one i don't know about always, always. so i can't fault uh, yes yeah, teenage always. boys yeah probably <laughs> yeah, yeah probably. exactly you were a teenage boy once i mean even the full-grown boys tend to <laughs> Way see, see, I, that I, I suppose what, too, I suppose my lacking wasn't definitely. desire; it was it was opportunity. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, what did Rafe find out? That, that's the big question of the yeah, week. What did Angela. Rafe find out, Angela? Uh, Jada was still married. But 
it really? Is that what it was? He got a phone call over that? Because he ran off and was like, Ava, Ava, Ava. I have to tell you this thing. The world has changed now. Everything is different. Oh, maybe not. See, you didn't even know. watch, did you, Angela? I thought it was the Jada Bobby thing. No, that was that was what closed out the week. Kind of. um, but on Thursday, I think, or mm -hmm. something, maybe it was Friday, but Rafe got a phone call at the station. And we really he didn't like, hear what? it. But he's like, what? Oh, my God. This changes everything. Like, and, and he, ran, he off. ran off. And then he, he struck up a conversation with Ava about it, but we never found out what the topic was. We don't know. Is right. it possible that Rafe find, found out that Harris was lying about not knowing who shot him? Ooh, ooh, maybe. Mm, right, maybe. We're going to find out. We're going to find out. Angela doesn't know, which makes it awesome. <laughs> you know, it's, like, it's a true secret Listen, in the days of our lives. The amount of things I don't know could just about fill the Grand Canyon. So, <laughs> you know. I just take you as, as the de facto expert on all things about to air. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, I don't know. I guess, I don't know. With, I without tried. JPI, I guess it's a little harder. And I saw, I, I, I saw, um, well, I, I saw a preview and Kristen and Nicole are mm -hmm. going to get into it hot and heavy next week. I can't wait. I can't wait. She wants oh, those yeah. Fists. She wants the those, mud on them. She wants those days mm -hmm. of our lives fights. <laughs> yep. Throw some mud on them. Goodness. <laughs> Goodness gracious. I'm here That's for the massage. Well, everybody. I'm just saying. Yeah, well, I'm looking forward to it. Oh, stop. I'm looking forward to Kristen and Nicole what, getting in each other's can't... face about things. <laughs> oh, goodness. Yes. Uh, and hey, Matt. Yeah. You're a boy who likes boys. You think girls can't like watching girls of mud wrestle? Yes, they can. And I can also tease you. So, <laughs> who's the hypocrite now? Yeah. Harley. All right. Well. Carly. Oh, don't really? Really? You want to catch some hands? No, I'm just teasing. Do you want to catch some hands? If you if you can. No, if you're, I'm not going to fight about something that doesn't really exist. Carly's a figure, not a person. <laughs> uh, let's see. Johnny Chanel almost did it on the prep table. Where the heck is Clyde? Pauline is happy. Eh, we got it. Well, I'm glad I was able to hop in for <laughs> the end times. I don't know if there's anything else to cover. Uh, you know, that's all. Uh, apparently, according to Jamie, Sammy and Nicole fights were epic. Yeah. So they were. Know. Well, I mean, you know, I feel for Nicole with her baby, but, you know, to say that this isn't a little bit of sweet justice would be disingenuous because mm -hmm. Nicole did steal Sammy's baby and pass it off as her own. So, yeah. You know, you're getting a little bit. Yeah. Of, I guess she's getting what she gave a little bit, huh? Well, comes to oh yeah. Karma. Yep. But we didn't. We didn't see that. I've I've only seen Nicole as the poor victim of circumstance. Right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. You got to go do the deep dive in the uh, Google Drive. Yeah. Yeah. I'll send the link to my mom, and she can probably not spend any time watching it, but she'll have access. I, I, yeah. <laughs> I, It'll be there. Yeah. She might sit down it's with the right, intention right, one right. day and put put on 10 minutes and be like, that was fun. Yeah, I just, I'm not a bit big on deep diving. She can hardly die. Well, well, we're lucky she watches the 10 hours of soaps we get out of her. Oh. And that's because they're on during the daytime. <laughs> <laughs> well. <laughs> okay. uh, all right. In closing, we'll, uh, we'll ask uh, Kelly so a question. So our lives. <laughs> uh, Kelly wants to know what's if, Kelly's question. I don't have the YouTube open. Did you I don't feel have the, the earthquake open. the other day, Angela? I did not. I'm a little north of Boston, and it didn't get here. I have felt earthquakes before, though, because I did spend many years living in California. There you go. And we got them, well, but I, I did not. Say, feel, the Earth did not move for me. I, I have to day. say, I had. I I kind of laughed at the New Englanders about the earthquake because you guys were sh a lot of folks were well, just shitting and getting. It well, was, oh, of course, thing, honey. <laughs> and you know they think the same thing about us when it comes to like lightning storms. You know, lightning storms and sends... or, or like if you guys got a blizzard. Yeah, like because lightning it sends energy. You wouldn't us. know what the hell to do. Like, no, yeah. absolutely not. I absolutely not. But you know, with an earthquake yeah. of a four point seven, you don't have to know a damn thing. <laughs> that's that's enough to know. Right, that but you also have to remember, though. and you also have to remember 
things here are not built with earthquake proofing. Ooh, that's true. That's you guys got a lot a of harder. really so a four point seven for you guys is not four seven. Their structures you know, are especially rigid. in they shake yeah, more. I mean in New York in the city. We we're we were built on Jello yeah. foundations. Yeah. Well, actually, if you have like an old bungalow right. that's made out of wood, that's that's all good right there because it just waves with it. And nothing, you know, I, I imagine if you're mm -hmm. plaster and bricks and stuff, bricks, you know, it's bricks, not gonna... bricks, especially old, old yeah. Boston and stuff. That's that's all yeah. brick, isn't it? Cheers but I just, made out of brick. I just, I just, yeah, but we didn't some... get it. It's we're asking yeah. cobblestone up there, but we didn't, we didn't feel this far. Old New, New England the, uh, architecture. Mass. Yeah. Well, yeah. I just saw one dude that on uh, there's there's a person I follow on TikTok and he's from there and he has lots mm -hmm. and lots and lots of uh, uh he he loves glass all this colored glass mm -hmm. his house is just packed full of colored glass it's beautiful <laughs> and, um, well he was just oh but nothing ever even fell over nothing even fell over in his house and he's panicking he's like I gotta go buy this putty and the like. Calm down, dude. You're never going to get another one of these anyway. You're going to have the app. Well, Nothing you never cool. know. We got this one. Yeah, but I don't know. I just found it common. So, I did. Uh, you know. <laughs> Y'all get a four point something every 40 years or so. <laughs> yeah. I I, oh, I'm just saying, you know, weather's getting worse everywhere. <laughs> that is I true. God had it up to here. Climate change. God, has, Mother Nature has had it up to here with us. Adding stress to these. She's fault about to lines. take us into the Kmart bathroom. <laughs> Mother <laughs> Nature is about to take us into the Kmart bathroom and beat our ass. We don't start <laughs> behaving. Specifically, the Kmart one. <laughs> that makes me. Oh gosh, Angela, that just makes me laugh because when my God, it brings you back, doesn't it? <laughs> I did this so many times. My kids. I knew that Mama Cat would. Get do you it. need to go to the bathroom? No, I don't need to pee. Are you sure you do not need to go to the bathroom? Because if you don't, you sure we don't need you to are going to the bathroom. bathroom. You are gonna have to go pee real soon if you don't knock it off. <laughs> scary. It's very scary. It's terrifying, really. <laughs> Matt just had flashbacks. And I did take Ma Melissa, not Matthew. I did take Melissa to the stall once or twice and paddle her ass. Yes, I did. <laughs> she was a bad kid, though. Just she was the worst. Rocky, okay? Who among us? <laughs> I don't know, Matt. I think you probably could have done with a few more Kmart bathroom spankings. I was a good kid, a terrible <laughs> 18 to 19 year old. Well, that's what I'm saying. If you had had a few more of those, you know, a few more spankings in the bathroom, it might have, you know, fixed up the last of those teen years. <laughs> Matt, Matthew was was a textbook middle child. He was trying to smooth uh, over everything. Uh, I do try to smooth over everything. Yeah. Well, not everything. You out there causing some trouble in those Twitter streets, too. Don't deny it. Hey, <laughs> once in a while when I've got a valid opinion on people's insanity. Yeah. Every once in a while, though, I try not to get trapped in the daily diatribe over stuff. Um, I'm happy to see that when it comes to the I days of our work. lives fandom, you know, there's people out there that aren't enjoying it, but it isn't a toxic hate fest that I found myself in, like in other places. So that days of our about. lives, Twitter streets, and days of our lives, Twitter streets can get a little, little punchy, but. You know, but they're not punchy the every right hour now, of every day, hour. every second that you're scrolling the time. No, <laughs> but all right, listen, just because some of us wake up and choose violence, <laughs> <laughs> even on the Lord's Day, you guys want to have some fun, my GHers, go over and take a look at my timeline. I've been having a good time the past couple days. <laughs> All kinds of passive aggressive bullshit on my timeline. <sighs> yeah, it's 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 gone away from aggressive and now it's passive aggressive. It's great. There's a really good freeze frame of you right now, Matt, on my screen. And there's a wonderful I know freeze frame internet. of you as well. Just just watch back <laughs> anyway. and see how uh, the many faces <laughs> and frozen poses of Angela during this broadcast. Uh, but that's it because I want more <clears throat> coffee. And Angela's gone, so we're leaving. <laughs> Get out of here before she can come back. That's it. I want more coffee. We have to prep for, for GH because, you know, it's the biggest GH week of all time, really. I mean, it just keeps on happening 
over on that show. Yes. So, you know, I got to prep for that. I got to mentally prep for that. I'm going to drink my coffee. to rest my voice. I'm going to make my notes. Maybe even change my shirt. Okay. I need to go downstairs and maybe bite something. <laughs> just just <laughs> take a bite out of my dad. <laughs> <laughs> Angela's back for now. Uh, hey, look at that. I didn't mean to pop off. I'm sorry. It's yeah, totally it's okay. I was, I was doing the sign off, you know. I was letting everybody out of the lecture hall. We're going to be back here for, for GH. Yeah, here everybody get out. Go. Uh, get on out of here. Class dismissed. Go enjoy the beautiful Sunday. Angela made yes, it. Yes. She made it, so we're happy about that. Yes. She, she, she rushed By the through skin hallways, of my teeth. her scarf <laughs> flowing and flapping mm -hmm. in the wind, the papers falling out of her folders. Absolutely. Papers falling out of my, my <laughs> professor's briefcase. Exactly. Exactly. She rushed to get here to say goodbye. Yep. So, hey, uh, like the video if you haven't, subscribe to the channel um, if you haven't done so already. If you want more of this Days of Our Lives chatter, GH chatter, and just soap life. Um, that's, that's, that's it, right? So, you can also go to pettyprattle.com oh, or Petty stuff. Prattle Podcast on Patreon for me and Tony's nonsense, which is all kinds of fun. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And they get into it. They get into all of it. <laughs> we do. <laughs> we bring the petty. All right. Hey, uh, be safe with the eclipse, says Kelly, and we will talk to you later. Uh, oh, there's no GH tomorrow because of that, right? No GH tomorrow, no. Well, it's yeah. a big national thing. It is. Even here well, in Los Angeles. Well, the beautiful get... and young and the restless are running. We're, well, sure ABC probably it, it expects on running news at the time. And so they just Yeah, well, you know, that out. bastard David um, here. Even here in LA, <laughs> we're going to get 50% coverage. So that's cool. Oh. Bay Area doesn't ever get to see an eclipse. Well. Not that I can recall. Enjoy. So, you know, I'm going to look directly in the sun as half of it's covered. Goodbye.